Hi everyone, I'm JJ with That The Reaction Squad and today we're going to be watching A Nightmare on Elm Street, the remake, the 2010 version. I haven't seen, I feel like I remember seeing like I know this about Freddy Krueger and I remember seeing a movie about Freddy Krueger but I don't remember which version I watched or anything to do with the movie. Technically kind of a flashback Friday but like not a flashback Friday because it didn't make enough of an impact for this to be nostalgic, you know? Uh, without further ado, let's get straight into the video. And don't forget to check out the channel for more content. Three, two, one. one two, three. I don't know if this is gonna get me. I've noticed recently as I grow up, scary movies just don't get me like they used to, you know? Do you guys like thunder and like, um, you know, rain and stuff? I love it. My boyfriend's terrified of it though. Can I have some more coffee, please? Where are you going? I don't think she wants to give you any more coffee, man. Excuse me? Bitch. Oh. Hello? Maybe she just really had to go to the bathroom. Hello? Is that Emmett? From Twilight? Anyone what the here? Heck? What are you doing here? Lady! Lady! Oh, you have a fire in your kitchen, ma'am. Hello? Buddy, I think something else is going on here, cause uh. Yeah. This would be the time you turn around. Jeez, this is what this- yeah, I'd be gone. Hello? Leaving? Okay, so the thing about Freddy Krueger is that he comes to you in your dreams. I don't know why, but he does. Emmett's about to get got by the Krueger. I had a music teacher. His last name was Krueger. I told you if you keep falling asleep, they're gonna kick you out of here. Um, sorry. Won't happen again, okay? You said that last time. Okay, what affects you in the dream affects you in real life. There was that one, like, song melody. I won't call it a lullaby, because, you know, yeah. But it's like one, two, Freddy's coming Nancy. for you, three, hey, four, that are you locked door. Actually, I'm, five, six, I'm get a crucifix, oh, seven, eight, Thanks. stay awake, nine, ten, never sleep again, or something like that. Hey. And she's from the Arrow. I haven't slept in three days. What are all these people doing in here? Dean, what's going on? So what are you doing after that? Bad things, bad things are happening. At least the bad boys. Oh, well, look out, it comes your girlfriend. Oh, hey. Hi, can I get you guys anything else? Uh, um... No, I think we're good. Okay. Is that the only thing you want to ask her, Quentin? Please leave me alone, I'm just trying to do my job. <laughs> Asshole. Hey. Why is Chris and Dean? You guys gonna cause issues? You look like the types, too. That's fucked up. What was that all about? Um, Jesse's just- he's pissed cause Chris broke up with him. I didn't even know they were together. Yeah. Okay, so he's a sour little ex. There's a lot of those in the world. He'll survive. I'm sorry about the mess these guys are just- I'm used to it. She ever get tired she is of a server. here every weekend? Did you ever get tired of coming here every weekend? Oh. Quentin. You coming or no? What? You're the one ushering me- ushering me to get her number. How about you hop off? Maybe you should talk to somebody. <sighs> I did. And he okay. thinks all my problems come from my past. We began going through my childhood, and that's when they started. Okay. When what started? These nightmares. Nightmares. So just don't look into your childhood and you'll be fine, right? So what, you, you can't sleep? I can sleep. 
I have the ability to sleep, but if I die, I mean, if I sleep, I will die. They're just dreams. Okay, they're not real. Say that to this. They're real. They're not. They're real. I'm sorry. No, it's okay. No, no, it's fine. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna go clean myself up. It's okay. It's okay. How long can you stay awake before your body just, like, betrays you? Uh-oh. Don't close your eyes. You'll fall asleep again. It's too late. And you're- it's too- it's gone. You're- you're gone. He's already here. You're not real! You're not real! You're not real! I am now. Oh. Dean, what are you doing? You're not real! Dean, stop it! Dean! Dean, stop it! <laughs> Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness! <laughs> Yo, they show- they show the- What? Is that little girl not real? Oh. Oh. Now you're gonna have the dreams because he mentioned them, perhaps? I don't know. I don't know how Freddy Krueger works. Whose dream- like, how does he pick his victims, you know? You knew Dean that far back. <sighs> Jesus, that is me. But I don't know how I'm in Dang. that picture. I didn't meet Dean until high school. Don't look into your past, that's how it gets you. You're not allowed to remember. Dean said something right before he died. Oh, please don't. He said, you're not real. He kept repeating it over and over again. Do you have any idea what that means? His face says he does. No. I don't. Are you a liar? Think about it. What would it mean that Dean was on a truckload of medication? Or... Jesse, when it happened, it was like somebody was making him do it, but... Uh-oh. There's nobody there. Jesse, you have to believe me. Chris, it was late, and you're scared. I think he believes you, but I think he's realizing that he's next. Oh, you also? Maybe you're next. Have you seen? <gasps> She's next. I saw. You didn't see anything. You weren't right there. Chris was. She's already fucked up, so leave her alone. Uh-oh, you're next, bro. Do what I've seen. It's gone. Oh no, she's gonna die next. And then it's gonna be Dean, and then it's gonna be the blondie. I don't know. It's the only people we've been- Oh! Quentin! Quentin has to come into play. Do you sleep? Let's find out. She's falling asleep. Oh. The time is reversing. Oh. The walls are moving. What in the world? So, do you sleep or do you not sleep? Because if you don't sleep, then I think you're next. Where are all the photos of me from when I was younger? They're not here. Oh, who knows? They're probably packed away over the garage. Why? Because today at the funeral, I, um, I saw a photo of Dean and I when we were like five, but you know, it's funny. I, I don't remember knowing Dean before high school. Who can remember being five years old? Hey, why don't you pack those Mom. up? Dinner's almost ready. 
Mom knows something, I think. I think she's suspicious. She knows something. She knows more than she's letting on, and I don't like that. She's being sneaky. A little rat. And you shouldn't be looking into it because Dean told you that once he started going, you know, digging deeper into his past is when these nightmares started. Spooky light! That's you! I know we babby. It's a doll that you played with. Oh. Do you have scars on your chest? Perhaps? Uh oh. That's not good. Oh, my goodness. Oh. Remember me? I- I don't. You were asleep. Chris? You okay? Okay, so was- Were- Were those, you know, clothes real then? Was that little box real? Was any of it real? No, like, if you ever- if you ever need somebody, you know, if you ever, ever want to talk to somebody, I'm- I'm sure you have like a thousand other people you could talk to, but if if, if you want to talk to somebody. Oh, he's so cute. Gwen. What? You'll be late to class. Come on, buddy, let's go. Fuck okay. off, Hank. I know. Damn. No. Hank, what what's up your ass, huh? Wake up, wake up, wake up. Oh my goodness, it's too late. You really shouldn't fall asleep in class. Get out of here, wannabe Wolverine. <laughs> oh. Hi, Chris. Who yeah. are you? You look. You know what he looks beautiful. like? As ever. Okay, creep. Anyways, you know what I realized? He kind of looks like Keep those out. monsters from uh, the de Descent. One little bit. You're a liar. Oh, wow. That, she has a good scream. That was a good freaking scream, like, actually. <laughs> Not even gonna lie. Does anyone else not see my hair? You didn't come in with a bag or something? Leave me alone! You're not gonna believe me anyway! You have to be careful while driving, man. These things start, you know? Nightmare on Elm Street. Maybe it's everyone who lives on Elm Street! My grandma lives on Elm Street. It's where I used to live. Guys? <laughs> oh god. If I start- if I start having nightmares about Freddy Krueger after this, I swear... I'll be pissed. <laughs> Hey. Hi. I have to fly to London on a red eye tonight. That's nice. You gonna be okay? Yeah, yeah. I'm fine. <laughs> I'm gonna be alright. Don't worry about me, man. Plate. I just worry about you. Try and get some sleep. Thanks, Mom. That might have been the worst advice you could have ever given me in your entire life. I love you. Love you. Just saying. Who? <laughs> It's gonna be the last time you see me alive, mother. Oh my goodness. Hi. Jesus, Jesse. What is wrong with you? What the hell are you doing here? Hey, you want me in? Yeah. The window's freaking open. You're not a freaking vampire, okay? Just come in. You're already banged on my window. Alright, I know I've been an asshole, and I've been jealous, and I've been fucked up. You're always but that way. was my friend, too. Was like, he? Please tell me what's been going on. I've already told you what's been going on. You said I'm crazy. These dreams. And I'm scared. I think Dean was having them too. 
and it killed him. So if you would kindly be on my side. I always see this man. His name's Freddy Krueger. He's burned and in it. He always has like a knowing face. What do you know, man? Knives on his finger. Tell me. Oh. He knows. I knew it! What? His face told it. Told the whole story. <laughs> We're having the same dream. Chris, it's not possible. It is possible. It's just a dream, <laughs> alright? First of all, it's a nightmare. Second of all. <laughs> Dean was having these dreams too, and now he's dead, so what do you think that means for us? All I want to do Don't is downplay to sleep, this. But if I do, he's gonna kill me like Dean. <sighs> then we should just stop talking about it, alright? We'll be talking about it, we'll just keep thinking about it, and we'll keep dreaming about it, okay? Maybe if we fall asleep with our heads connected, then we can fight them together, you know? Maybe he'll stay with me. Of course I'll stay with you. I'm still in love with you. Obviously, I'll stay with you. The song I was talking Come about. Come on. I can see. We have to hide. What do you mean? Four, three, Stay up late. Two, one. You failed at hide and seek. Oh, Here that I sound. Come. We're fine, everything's okay. Are you sure you're awake? <laughs> Cause now I'm second guessing it. Jesse. Jess. Alright. He's too tired to care about your issues right now. I thought I thought he was gonna get his her Achilles. Why are you smiling? Something's gonna happen. Found you. Oh my god. You look funny, Chris. Um. Damn. Oh my. Wake up! Oh. Not gonna lie. Not being able to see. Mr. Is she fucking dead? Oh shit! Oh god! Is she actually dead? Wait! 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 Oh. What? <laughs> Fuck! She's dead? Like, actually dead? What the hell? <laughs> Wait, is that Rufus? Is Rufus okay? That you would want that, right? Honey. Like, yes, please call the fucking cops. My ex is dead? Hey, hey, stop. Here. Just listen to me, okay? What happened to you? Um, uh, you know, shit, what's her name? I was with Chris. And Chris. I, I didn't do anything to her, that's what I'm trying to tell you. Now listen to me, something's going on, okay? Tell me what happened to Chris, Jesse. Someone killed her in her sleep. Yeah. His name is Freddy Krueger, and he has a burnt face. Don't pretend like you don't know. Because you do. You said it at the funeral. Someone is trying to kill us in our dreams. I keep hearing this song. What song? One, two, Freddy's coming for you. One, two, Freddy's coming for you. Freddy. Freddy Krueger. It's his name and he's in all of our heads, Nancy. That's impossible. Nancy. It's not impossible. I'm telling you the truth. If you die in your dreams, you die for real. Oh, 
Okay, surely they don't see. Okay. Never mind, apparently they see you. I'm not moving. Get down! Get down! I didn't do anything! Get down! Listen to me, I didn't do anything, I swear! Please! Get down! Just comply. I'm tremendous! Take a knee, kill her! I didn't do anything! Stop! Shut up! Get up! Jeez Louise. Okay, we have to keep we can't have to keep calm here. Get up! Okay. They don't know anything, so when you get into the interrogation room, immediately ask for a lawyer. And then you know in custody. Nancy! You know! You know who did it! Jeez, uh. And then he's gonna die because he's gonna fall asleep in a holding cell. Open the door. Just don't get into any fights where you get knocked out. Hello? Hi, it's Nancy. Hey. I just had to call you if I needed to talk. Here I am. Quiet! Oh, jeez. Shut the fuck up! <laughs> oh, gosh. I feel like he's obviously gonna be next to die, because what can he really do? Quite literally stuck. Is he also experiencing it? How does- okay, how does he- how does, you know, Kruger pick who this happens to? You know? Is it because of the town? Is it because of the street they live in? Is it because of the people they know? Like... Open floor! Please don't sedate me. Folks posted your bail. Really? Perfect! <laughs> Unless he's dreaming right now, this camera angle is giving me dream vibes right now. I don't like that. It's over. Slap yourself awake, scream awake. It didn't work for Chris, so well. <gasps> well, that's not good. I think it's time to run. I agree. I agree with this. <laughs> it's over for him, though. What's he? What can he do? Unless his, like, cellmate or one of the cops wakes him up. So... Oh god. No. Just me. Ugh. Were Chris and Dean his only two victims? Is this, like, the beginning? Do you think you can bring the dead back to life? No. Mm -mm. No! No! I didn't fucking think so. No! 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 Why are you screaming? I haven't even caught you yet. Yeah, yet. I know you're gonna. <laughs> I'm afraid of you, sir. God, there's gonna be a jump scare. There's gonna be a jump scare. It's coming. I can feel it! <laughs> Yo! I didn't do it! I'm innocent! That poor guy. Freddy, you're ruining so many lives. Fuck off. Zoneral. It's basically, um, speed for kids with ADD. I've been on it since I was like 15. No. No thanks. Nancy, yeah, look, you're running on fumes here, okay? Are you sure? It's. Yeah, I'm fine for now. I don't like drugs. I didn't uh, take you for the religious type. Yeah, we gotta blame something, you know? Yeah, fair enough. His brain will begin to shut down its functions for several seconds and attempt to recharge itself. This basically means that you're dreaming, <clears throat> but you don't know it. 
Uh -huh. Even if you're awake. And then it says that after that, your brain will shut down, inducing a coma. Oh! Just permanent sleep. Oh! <laughs> Basically, we're running out of time. Do I have some sort of connection with Chris? Dean and Jesse? Or Quentin? Like maybe we went to school together when we were little or something like that? Mm-hmm. Not that I can recall. Do we ever know a guy named Freddy? I don't think so. You're a liar. Why are you lying? Okay. Good night. Good night. You're lying. But why? Who are you calling? Hey, it's Gwen. Nancy's starting to remember. Bitch, if you don't start telling me the truth when I only have a few more days to live. like that don't fall asleep in the water he's gonna drown you kind of weird kind of creepy honey you okay yeah I'm fine mom all right I'm going to bed okay mother I'm not okay and I'm about to die oh Never mind, she's fine. Her hair is hella dry. Not like hella dry, but like since she was just in the bath and like surprised that it's dry, you know? You're dreaming and that's really not good. <laughs> oh, but maybe you'll learn some important things. That can help you and Quentin survive. And if not, I have no Hello, idea how to Nancy. help you. Oh, grown up. You're just a nightmare. You're not real. You're dead. No one can prove I was ever here. Oh. Who are you? <laughs> Freddy Krueger. Don't remember. I don't. You're my number one. Excuse me? You're my... You're making me uncomfortable, Mr. Freddy. Freddy. Okay, that's really fucking gross and uncomfortable. What? Nancy, you got to him, Jesse's dead. He died in his sleep. I saw him. What is the lore? I fell asleep, I saw Freddy. All right, I'm coming over. Okay. No more falling asleep, Nancy. We're running out of fuel. Adam's a preschool. It's on the other end of town. It was closed okay. years ago. So in preschool is when shit shit went down. I drew this after my dream. I don't know. What to, I've, I've, I've never seen it before. Well, How is the guy in our dreams connected to the school? I mean, time to go look through some books and newspapers. You know, the good old Dean and Sam Winchester type shit. What? We're all here. Okay. Chris, Jesse, Dean. Okay. So, it's everyone in the preschool class. In that specific preschool class. What are you doing? What are you doing? We have to know. You said that... You said that we didn't know each other. Yeah, well... 
but we're all in I'm a big fibber. We went to school together. Give me the picture. It's okay. Why would you lie to me? I didn't lie. You did lie. Why would you lie to me? Stop lying to me. I'm, I'm not lying, lying to you. To I am not Stop lying, lying, to lying to you. I'm not lying to you. I didn't want you to have to go through your life with this memory. I didn't want you to remember. I wanted you to forget. Yeah, well, it's too late. He was a gardener. Okay. He lived in the basement of the preschool, and you kids were his life. Okay. We did. So where does it all go bad? You all were so innocent. Here I come. And you, Nancy. What are you drawing? That is so good. You were his favorite of all. You know what? I got some other- What does that mean? Really bad drawings? Maybe you can help me fix them? And then we started to notice things. What? Yeah, uh, he has been acting a little- S Slicing him up? So what did you do? Did you call the police? He left town before we ever were able to confront him. Okay. He's gone. He can't hurt you anymore. You say that. So these dreams that you're having, they're... They're repressed memory. It's not true because they're killing... He's killing my friends. Quentin, it doesn't make any sense. There's gotta be more to it than this. It's not... This makes total sense, okay? You heard what Does your mom it? said. These are just fucked up memories. What if but she's we're wrong? We're experiencing them, we're, 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 we're living them, but they're just memories. How do you know that? Memories don't kill you. Yeah. We have things to do. Quentin, get in the car. It's my dad, I gotta go. We have to do Look, something. Stop. This is crazy, listen to yourself. Okay. I hope you die next then. What's the deal with you, Hank? Why are you so grumpy? I want you to do four and warm up, then do a 200, back press. Are you gonna drown? Focus here, I need you to wake up and get into this. Let's go. All right, guys, step up. Let's go on the blocks. It would be pretty ironic that the person on the swim team drowns. All right, time to find some people. Come on! Uh oh. That's not good. That is not- it's not good to fall asleep underwater, sir. <laughs> What's the big idea? What's going on? Let me know. Going on. Are these all the parents of the children he was fucking with? What are you doing? No, 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 no. This isn't the right way. We've got it. And what is the right place. way? Our kids get on a stand and have to tell a room no, full of people no, what happened no, tonight. Right, We've got to call the He's police. right. This is not the this way. Ends to do tonight. This. Okay. So they burned him alive because of what he was doing to their children. This is for my son. He uh, chased me into the preschool this time. I got away, made it down into the basement. But it feels like that's where he wants me to go. Like, he needs me to find- Oh jeez. Okay. I'm starting so... to dream with my eyes open. I can't tell what's real anymore. Is he still alive? I slept in three days. I don't know. If I sleep, I dream. And if I dream, I die. Is there anybody else out there that this is happening to? Can somebody- Help me, please. Is he still alive? <laughs> I 
And he died. Jeez Louise, man. They're all dead. All I of them? What happened to Freddy? You killed Kruger. Where'd you hear that name? You chased him, you cornered him, and you burned him to death. You hunted him! We did not hunt him. We were protecting him. From what? From him. From what he did to you. From what you kids told us he did. We were to. five! We would have said anything! Why didn't you go to the police? Oh, jeez. Did you ever find it? No. How do you know oh. he was guilty? Oh, God. Oh, jeez. You killed an innocent man. <laughs> There's not a day that goes by that I don't think about that night, Quinn. Oh, jeez. But you deserve at least that. Quinn, when you grow up and you have kids... I'm not gonna grow up. I hope you never know the feeling of utterly failing to protect them. Don't Son, touch me. I... Don't touch me. Okay, why don't, why don't you guys, like, tell them? Like, hey, man. We're dying in our dreams. That entire class of kids. As far as everyone around here is concerned, Fred Krueger never existed. Well, I'm about to never exist. Quentin! Why don't they say something? Quentin, wait! Like, hey! What? Slow down! We're all dying in our sleep because of what you did. Our stories, our lies. What if we can make him stop? What if we can? What about the preschool? Marcus said that Freddy wanted him to find something. Fine. If you don't keep walking... What are you doing? Micro sleep. I just saw Chris in a body bag. Alright, you've been up for too long. Grab a micro now, so we gotta go. Let's go find the preschool. Yeah, we gotta skedaddle. What are we doing here? I need more pills. Gotta stay awake. Come on. Come on. Maybe I should have went in together so that you guys can like keep each other in check. On this, uh, you're out of refills. I'm gonna have to uh, call the doctor on this. Look, I, I don't have a, I don't have time to call a doctor. Look. Oh jeez, this isn't going so well, guys. Look, I've been on this stuff since I was, I was 15. Okay, it's totally fine. You just, you just, you just go back. Do you fill it up? And even just a couple. All I need no, is a couple. No, no, I'm sorry. It could very much get him uh, fired. Oh, what is that, Miss Ma'am? Don't do that. <laughs> what is wrong with you? All of that, and you still fell asleep. Just fill it up. No. Quentin! Miss Ma'am, I think you're still asleep. Even after you did that to yourself. Which is crazy. That's not good. Not good. At all. Uh oh. This is where uh, Dean was when he died in his dream. No. Stop sliding your little scissor fingers together. Freaking me out. Wake up! You're bleeding. What's going on? Okay. Guys, we're out of time. We gotta go. Sweater. Okay. He's here. Man, you're hurt really bad. It's a good thing you're in the- Oh, Let's go to the pharmacy. <laughs> Come on. I was gonna say, good thing you're in the medical section, but they're literally in a pharmacy, so every section's a medical section. What happened? Who did Kruger's this after me. Look at him, you know who did it. You know who did it. Don't play with me! You're gonna get in trouble. Have an apron! 
Is that a good thing? I don't know. I don't know what effort okay. it is. Okay, how we doing? It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna give you a little something for the pain. It'll put you right out. No, thank you. <sighs> I don't want it. I don't want it, Mom. I don't want it. It's okay. It's okay. Please don't give that to me. You're gonna get me killed. It's sting a bit. No! No! Oh, okay, okay. No! Where is Quentin? Can I have a word with you in the hall? Don't leave. Don't leave, Mom. Mom! Where is Quentin? I need Quentin. Jeez Louise. You guys are gonna get me killed. Great. Alright, buddy. Thank goodness, cause y'all were about to get me killed. Adrenaline to keep us awake. Where'd you get it? I stole it off one of the nurses' carts. You can't just take that. You have no idea what it's gonna do to you. You know what? That is kind of the least of my concerns right now. Very true. So... No. Ah. Ew. Then I'll take you out on a real date. Aw. Who said I was gonna go on a date with you? Well, what if I say no? Yeah. What happens then? Stalker? <laughs> okay, your brakes don't do shit. I saw he's right there. We gotta go. Come on. Yeah, even the adrenaline's not helping you, so we gotta blast. This must be his room. Okay. He brought us here for a reason. Why? This is definitely his room. Yeah, but why? What's the big idea? The cave! Have you? If you can keep a secret, I'll take you to a special place. Okay. Nancy. Well, careful. It's kind of dark in here. We might need that flashlight. What are those? Also, I'm surprised you guys have been awake for this long. About your little micro what are those pictures of? They're all of you. Oh. I wanna see. No. What is it? I'm scared now. No. Oh god. <laughs> no! What? We were wrong. He's not after us because we lied. What? He's after us because we told the truth. Oh. He brought us here so that we would remember what he did to us. Oh. Fuck! Fuck! How, there's, is there just no way of stopping him then? From us, he's never gonna stop! Yeah, that's what I'm saying. What? Why? I know what we need to do. Wanna fill me in on this little plan that you have? I should do this. I'm the one who pulled the sweater out. What if I'm the only one who can bring him out? Nancy, I can't let you go to sleep. You're not gonna wake up. You don't know that. How long do you need? Wake me up if you see me struggle. Oh, okay. I'll try. To protect you. One of them's gonna die. I think. That's my prediction. Hey, maybe not. Maybe it's a happy ending and they both survive. Together. How do you know he's not also gonna w fall asleep? <laughs> Quentin, your only job is to not fall asleep. It's gonna be really hard. Okay. Well, you know, you tried. You tried your hardest, and I... I commend you for that. Oh, shit. Yeah. Shit. 
It's too late. It's over for the both of you. You can't save her! Frick you. Tag. You're it. Oh. Your girlfriend's here. I'll be right back. Oh. Well. Shit. He's dead. Which means she's also gonna die. What is going on? This is a fever dream. Well. Unless Quentin is somehow alive. And he survived somehow. This dress was always one of my favorites. You're a fucking creep. Do you remember it, Nancy? Mm. Of course you do. I don't remember shit, and you're making me uncomfortable. Your memories are what fuels me. <laughs> no, please don't. You're making me uncomfortable. Your says no. But your body. I'm uncomfortable. Like I'm mass amounts of <laughs> mass amounts of uncomfortable. Nancy, please. You Smack really her in the face. Your boyfriend could wake you up. Please don't do this. Smack her. Please. I know you don't want to like smack your, you know, girl, but. Come back, please. Wake up. Wake up. I promise. You know. Oh, it's gonna push a boundary. She said she didn't want it. But it's gotta happen. Sweet dreams. Oh! You did it! Quentin, get him! I'm a little, you know, hurt. Nancy, get him! <laughs> Your turn. He's a little strong. Nancy, it's all on you now. Nice try, Nancy. Now let me take a stab. Did that hurt? Okay, Quentin's kind of the MVP right now. Nancy, I'm gonna need you to fucking die. Step up your game. You. It hurts, doesn't it? It's because you're in my world now, bitch. Yeah. Gotta love the one-liners. You did it! I think. Cut off his head just to be sure. You know, just for extra measure. Double tap type shit. Wait. Slice off his head. Oh, burn his bot. Okay, yeah, that also works. Hey, Quentin. Nightmare's over. You say that. I don't trust it though. Hey, man. I know you're just trying to protect me. Thank you. I'm just glad you're safe. <laughs> oh! Oh my goodness. Pretty good movie. Kind of got me like, whoa, you know? It didn't like make my heart race, but. It did surprise me with a few of their, you know, little jumpy scares. Um, the gore was definitely a surprise. I did not think it was going to be that disgusting. It's a good little classic. It's obviously the remake. Um, I will be sure to react to the actual, you know, original. It was a fun little movie. Very dark. Very dark. 
so dark. I did not know it was going to take that turn. It is so dark. Holy moly. With that being said, thank you guys so much for joining me on this journey for a Nightmare on Elm Street 2010 version. Thank you guys so much for watching. Comment down below any other reactions you'd like to see me do on this channel. Like the video if you enjoyed it. Subscribe to show your support and I will see you guys next time. Bye!